Switch to bare hands and use a secondary action key. For what? Oh, just drink Drinking some water. water. Bare hands! <laughs> I haven't got any bare hands. There's already a grill in the grill. You feel warm by the fire. Right. Ooh, 51 iron arrowheads. Oh, I'm making iron arrowheads. So there should be half the amount for you in the forge. In the forge, you'll share. Let's yeah. go and have a look. Uh, there are 125 arrowheads here, but there is nothing cooking in the forge, so I'm going to turn that off. Uh, we need calipers, tool and die set. I'm fairly sure I saw one of those. Yeah, we uh, we got that like super early, didn't we? Super, super early. Yeah, we did. There we go. I've put that in there. That's probably I pooped the it in stuff. there, you know. Sorry, I missed what you were saying. It's all right. <laughs> Talking all over you. I know. Look, there's new new blocks. Clay roof block. Clay roof full corner. There may, might not be new blocks, it might just be blocks I've never seen before. But they're there, they're, they're there. I can't have a look while you're in oh, it. sorry. Yeah, they're nice. Wow. Well, yeah, they're all right. They're all right. I like the roof. The so, roof. we've explored a bit more of the town. We know exactly what's going on now. Uh, I kind of feel that in the middle of the top two bits, can you have a look at your map so we know what's going on? You see that one in the middle, that down one, down one, that one exactly there. I think that's the one where we should be setting up our defensive structure. Okay. Right in the middle of that, we should probably go and take down whatever house that is there. Yeah. Um, let's mark that up for the morning, uh, and then think about making. I don't know. What What do you think we should do for our defensive being? Because we've got two days. Two days. It's about to turn into day six. I think we start building the defensive structure. Because then if there's time left over afterwards, we can do stuff then. But I'd like the defensive structure set up. I don't yeah. want to be panicking on the morning of day seven. I am in full agreement. But the question was, what are we going to build for the defensive structure? What are we? What's it going to look like? Is it going to be a pillar in the middle with sets of stairs leading up either side with a small jump gap to keep safe? Is it going to be just a squat square cylinder with a lip on the top and then... Uh, I don't know, uh, stairs going up the middle? Well, as you have already decided upon this, you want to build some pillars, right? With some stairs to jump up onto the pillar. That, that would be nice. Is it safe And then another here? further pillar to jump over to when that first one starts breaking. Yeah, I mean, hopefully it will never get to the point where the pillars start breaking because we'll have, like, standard defensive structures around it, like things like the log spikes and the... Uh, Log, log spikes. <laughs> I hear the barbed wire is good, and we, we never really make use of it. Do we have enough scrap to make barbed wire? Not right now, but Not it's right something now. we can work towards. Okay. Um, yeah, this, this house just I over mean, here. breaking down that house, that might give us some I'll extra give us scrap. loads of scrap. I'm just, I'm just kind of having a slow stroll over there right now, actually. Is that your feet I can hear? Yeah, probably. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. This but is the house that needs to outline. come down. This one in front of us, yes. Your skybox is a lot brighter than mine. I can't can't see the outline of the house against my, my skybox. Aww. So th this is the one. Look, straight away, there's a source of scrap right here. Right outside. Do you have a wrench? I do have a wrench. Not really getting much from it. I'm going to go in and start raiding the stuff so we don't lose it. Okay, cool. You um, know we're going to lose a bookshelf, right? I'd say a single bookshelf is not the end of the world. And like Most of the major skills now are done in the skill tree anyway, rather than being done in the in books. Uh, yeah, I know. It's just maybe that's the bookshelf that gives us the, uh, the spiked club. <laughs> well, thankfully, um, it's kind of all a random chance. So all bookshelves have the same chance of giving us that. So if we just look in the same number of bookshelves, it would still happen. I did a very bad job of explaining that, but that's basically my reason why mean. I'm not... Yeah. <laughs> do you happen to have an iron pick? I do not. I don't have an iron pick or an axe looking at my uh, my inventory here. That's that's not great. Okay. Nice. Do you want to run back and make a couple of iron picks? Do we have the equipment for such? I don't know. No, I don't know either. I will go check. I will go check. Um, it's very dark out here. Let's get my club in my hand. I feel a little bit safer with a strong hard shaft of wood in my hand. There's a spare head torch if you don't already have one. I know, I've got one, thank you. You've got one. Thank thankfully. Whew. But it's still, like, I don't know, my, my screen just seems very, very dark. Do you want to up your settings or something? Yeah, but then during the day or when there's more than one torch on the go, wow, white out. Yeah. yeah. So, uh, what was I here for? I was looking for things to make. Uh, 
<laughs> yeah, I was looking for things to make, you know. An iron pick. So, oh, are we going to break the house by hand, or do you want to make some explosives? How are we doing? Oh, I found iron leg armor schematic. Uh, oh, well, obviously, like explosives are much better way of going. So we want to pick an axe, right, to share? Uh, I'd say a pick each. I've already got an axe. Okay. Um don't quite have the iron for that, I don't think. Okay, Let's just make the one then. I, oh no, I'll just make some more forged iron, that's alright. Um, I'll turn out... Ooh, ooh. I was going to turn out another ten, but I can only turn out five. I was going to just do the five that we need, because we'll get some scrap metal from here. Yeah, yeah, this is true. Uh, so I'm making a pick, and I'm going to make an axe as well. Okay, yeah, I already have an axe that I found, so that's not a problem for me. Okay, cool. I'm on my way back. If we're lucky, we'll spawn a witch. <laughs> oh, yeah, that'd be interesting. Uh, it'll be uh, a, a good test of our combat prowess at the moment. It will be just like a small number of like relatively easy to deal with zombies. Yeah. Uh, oh. That should be pretty pretty cool. Pretty cool. Cute. Okay, I am making an entrance through the back door. Hey. <laughs> Always. Always make an entrance. Uh, you've raided down here, I believe? Uh, I think so, yeah. You left the TV on the wall, and like, oh, well, I, mean, I hear you, you jumping. Take the TV if you wish. No, no, it's okay. I mean, there's plenty around in the town. It's not like we're short of TVs. So I'm not seeing anything that I'm feeling too sorry to lose. No, you probably want to break down the oven and the fridge for the metal. Yeah, yeah, straight up. Uh, straight sinks. Up. I've pretty much raided everything else, I'm sorry. <laughs> that's alright, that's fine. It's what you do. Go around and take everything before I can get there. Of course. <laughs> uh, right, I want that on. Yeah, just balancing my in uh, inventory. So, sink. We want to get the taps first. The taps are a very important part to get. It took us forever to realise that taps were a separate thing from the sink. I know. Like, I don't like the fact that they changed them to iron now as well, because you get a mixture of brass and iron, whereas yeah. before they were all brass. I know, I kind of like it, I kind of like it. The thing I don't like is the fact that it's very hard to tell what the brass ones... If the Which brass ones, ones look like brass, yeah, because yeah, cause they don't. They, Well, I mean, I suppose they're a bit of a straw colour rather than... rather than the, uh, the yellow that I associate with brass in my head. Um, Smashing up the oven. This is good. I like this. Sorry, I'm smashing up lights. I don't know if this is actually effective or not. They've got a durability of 250, which takes a while with my rubbish little uh, stone axe. Uh, I'll go around and take a few out with the pickaxe. It's to right. Be fair, you bought some iron, right? Uh, I cooked some iron. Cooked I some may iron. not have brought it with me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well then I'll just go back and get that myself then, shall I? I've got a single bit of iron. <laughs> That's no good. I won't even make me a shovel. It's not like Minecraft, you do know. You, do you want a shovel? i got a shovel. No, oh, I've just made a shovel. <laughs> <laughs> so why do you want to make a shovel? I don't. <laughs> I want to make an axe. <laughs> but you said you had an axe. Oh, have I not laid a bedroll yet? Have you not laid oh, no, a bedroll? Oh, no, it's roll? okay. Laying a bedroll? What's, 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 the, what's the real past tense there? Laid. Have, have I laid a bed roll? <laughs> no, see, I knew this once. It's gone out of my mind. No, if, if, if we really cared, we could go check Google. Google is the way forwards there. Okay, there Indeed. is a gun safe here, but it's going to take the entirety of my pickaxe to get through it. Okay. So I'm not sure whether it's worth it, and Joe isn't giving, giving any good stuff. No, he won't. Oh, look, I picked up a barbed wire club. Did you? Yeah. Nice. Is it terrible? <laughs> yeah, it's got a durability of fifteen. Yeah, that's pretty terrible. I've got to say, this axe that I make, that I've made, not much better, and oh, it's going to take a while to to take stuff down. How much gunpowder do we have? Do you know? I will take a quick look now. Ah, so we've got hundreds or thousands. There is no gunpowder at the moment, but we have enough coal and nitrate powder to probably make nearly 2,000. Okay, that's pretty cool. Okay, it yeah. is one for one, isn't it? Uh, two. Oh, two so maybe gunpow a thousand then. Yeah, two, it's two coal and potassium nitrate to one bit of gunpowder. Right. So we kind of need to get... Um, oh, you've organised it in here, haven't you? Get mining at some point. Organised? I don't. I don't organise stuff. What? In fact, yes, I did. You but did. My mining tools is now level four. 
Ooh. I'm just swinging an axe against the wall. It's not going to really do much. Um, Maybe you should uh, grind some tools up and make that a little bit better. Yeah, I mean, I'm making an axe of 44 at the moment. It's not Aye. the best. Okay, I'm literally just going to sit here in front of this gun safe and crack it open, as we are probably intending to blow it all up at some point. Um, I'm thinking the best place to, to hit it with TNT would probably be the corners. Yeah, it will collapse itself then. I Hopefully. mean, we probably could just try and dig the floor out from underneath and see if it's that makes it go. got a basement and foundations and stuff like that. We'd, Has we'd, it got a basement? I'm in the basement right now. Oh, I missed I that. I found the gun safe in the basement. And I'm, I'm now, sorry. <laughs> that's quite alright. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Well, we also need to check to see how the farm is doing, if anything is worth turning over. And I think I checked it just before we left, so not going to do much good now, maybe. I don't know. It, it needs checking. Always needs checking. I will go and check it as I leave here, then. Cool. I've also completely run out of stamina, but I think something's running around upstairs. Really? Sorry, I was oh. just about to turn 4 o'clock anyway. It's alright, I won't be able to hear it. Too far away for me now. That gave me no iron whatsoever. No iron at all? Well, six pieces. To me, that is nothing. Uh, yeah, I only not got like 11 and then some like taps. It's not worth it. Where are we putting the clay? In the furnace so far. Ah, uh, it's just going straight in. Yeah, I think we need to put a box down next to it. Yeah, that would be a good idea. Inventory management, yeah, again. <laughs> So half the thing of these survival games is just learning how to carry the stuff you want to carry. Yep. Right, farm. Yes, the farm. Oh, no, hang on. I came here for a reason. Did you? And what reason was that? To get the forged iron to make a pick. Ah, indeed, yes. Did the forged iron not come out? I... Oh, what did you do? Oh, no. It's like, more what you didn't do, right? Yeah, I must have like not clicked the button or something like that. I'm sure there's going to be a cut showing exactly what I didn't do now. Oh. Turn it off. I was going to turn out another 10, but I can only turn out 5. That will be amusing. <laughs> okay, cool. <laughs> I shouldn't really call editor, editor me out like that. I'm, I'm now going to have to go and do some work. I mean, like, bah. <laughs> <laughs> Aw, poor you. I know, I know. It's not like you do much else, to be fair. Oh, what? I've, I've got other gaming series this is on the go, or a, another gaming series on the go. I have got the worst parts here. Uh, short shotgun barrel, 35. Um, I've got a feeling we're probably going to be melting all these down, right? Yeah. To be honest, the pit bits that I picked up weren't much better. Okay, and you were complaining about the lack of iron. Okay, so the farm is not ready to turn yet. Brilliant. I'm just going to come back and, uh, no, I'm going to go back and get the forged iron, because that should be cooked now. Cool, I'm going to come back and dump all this stuff that I've just picked up. So, all the of the useful things have been broken down, right? Fridge, sinks, oven. Uh, maybe not so much the sink or the oven. Okay. Um, there's these large TV parts, I'm going to scrap these down. There's a lot to break down, in fact. The hardest bit's probably going to be breaking down these middle walls. Smash! Oh, I got a load of uh, broken glass out of that medicine cabinet. Oh, did you? Yeah. Well, you I got two bits of do that, right? two bits of broken glass, one each. Uh, lovers tryst, right? <laughs> yep. <laughs> Romeo and Juliet. Smashing up the toilet because I'm a rebel. Ah! Yeah. Who needs toilets in the apocalypse? I'm just going to go in the corner. Ah. <laughs> No change there then. <laughs> yeah, you really do need to sweep that out at some point. It's becoming quite a pile. Um, That's not my job. Right, so did we find enough gunpowder to make some TNT? Oh, I didn't make it. Did oh, you not no. make it? Oh, you're having a bit of troubles out there. I'm alright, I'm alright. Okay, cool. Just kind of taking this middle pillar out the support, Ooh. well, what appears to be a support wall, see if that'll do any good for when the uh, actual explosions come round. So are you back at the house? No, no, I'm inside the building we're trying to take down, or will be trying to take down. Okay, I'm Mining gonna go... tools are going up again. I really need to start using like my, my axe or something, my stone axe. Um, get my construction tools up rather, rather than my mining tools. But I've got a feeling maybe, just maybe, the stone axe will work as the mining tools when you're breaking stuff and construction tools when you're fixing stuff. I don't know if that's a thing. No, but it's something we can test. Hi. 
I. It will take a long time to test that. <laughs> yeah. Do you want me to leave you half of the coal and half of the potassium so you can make your own gunpowder? Uh, no, I ain't, I ain't overly fast. I mean, I'm gonna I'm gonna get a high enough gun sk gun smithing skill at some point anyway. I'm gonna make it all myself then. Okay, that's cool. Um, do we want to dig out one of these clay pits and start making some cobble? Yes. Yes, okay, because cobble is probably, given our construction skill um, level, the best stuff that we're going to be able to, dip, yeah. build, to build with. So I'm going to swap that out for that. I'm going to come to the forge and drop some stuff in there. Oh, hey, how's it going? Good. I see you in the doorway there. So I'm going to leave you to get on the cobble while I start demolishing. Is that okay? Yeah, yeah, if that's what you like to do, we can do it that way. I mean, we should really do stuff together if nothing else it provides good better footage when we can see each other it um, does but you need to get that forge on the go for the cobble because it's going to take some time oh no no cobble you make in your in your inventory really yep oh okay well you could bring some with you and i could make it oh wow i could yes uh, sorry you could bring some with you and i could make it but i am making gunpowder so that one i have to finish first wooden club to burn Ugh, recycling stuff that's what it's all about feel good about the environment when you're like melting your own stuff right <laughs> yep <laughs> the, these hippies nowadays they just don't know how to recycle properly they think taking it down to that green bin's the good one I mean, like no you want to get get a fire going and melt it because <laughs> that'll help the environment yeah do we when taking this house down so I start taking the corner out do I actually want to take out the inner walls first uh, I have begun taking out some of the inner walls ok let's go in there and do that uh, there's not many inner walls left to be far do you know that base block has a durability of 3000 the stone floor block? really yeah I oh, started wow. hitting it with my axe and was like oh jeez on your travels back, if you could bring some water and maybe a couple of cans of food, that would be nice. Oh, are you kidding me? Uh, water and a couple... Oh, I'm going out to a, a clay pit first. Oh, okay, yeah, no worries. I'm not desperate, it was just one of those thoughts. That clay pit right there, in fact. Um, yeah, I need to take some waters with me myself, actually. Someone needs to cook some golden rod at some point. I'm waiting for it to grow, unless there's any left in the fridge. There's like 12 in the fridge or something like that. Okay, the other thing we need to do is find out if this town has one of the flooded basement houses. No, 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 we don't. We've got water, water, pool, uh, water pools? Swimming oh, we've pools got a swimming pool, yeah. Everywhere. <laughs> but it won't take long to empty that. Really? Really? Uh, that, that's a challenge. Let's, let's do it. Let's try and empty a swimming pool. I, th I think it's going to take us longer, but I really, really like the idea. Yeah, yeah, I reckon it's going to take a while to empty a swimming pool. See, I don't see them being very deep. Oh, no, they're only three or four blocks deep, but they're also like 15 blocks long or something like that. And, um, you know, five blocks wide. Quick bit of maths would give you an answer to that. Um, <laughs> I, might, I might do that at some point, but not right now. Oh. I'm digging. It'd just be nice if my uh, tools would last long enough. Well, you know, the lo less time that your tools last, the more time you're spending improving Crafting. your fixing of... St well, maybe not the fixing, but the construction of tools. And the better all overall we get as players. I know, does that, does that make us better players, our skills getting better? Like, maybe if we were getting more actions per minute or something like that, we were learning to click the mouse faster? <laughs> that might, yeah. <laughs> that would make us better players, right? <clears throat> I'm, not sure, I'm not sure where the line is there, because, like... The whole thing of the gaming industry is about the power fantasy, right? Making you feel better and better about what's going on. Oh, there's a deer just over there. You f do you think that by uh, seeing your skill in construction improving, you feel like a better gamer? Yeah, yeah. I think that's the that's what they're trying to inspire in you. They're, they're trying to be like, oh look. Digging a hole used to take you forever. Now look how quick it is. You can take out a block in one go. Aren't you a good gamer? And you're like, well, actually, I'm just someone who put the hours in. Yeah, that's how I feel. Or, oops, I found an auger. Now it takes me five seconds. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Man, augers. Have we ever actually had a completed auger? We have. We have Once. I remember having a completed auger, but it was a long time ago. Yeah, it was. It was a very long time ago, one of our early games. Might even be like Alpha 12, maybe? Like we've changed two Alpha versions since then? Very possibly. 
You used to have a right click menu. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I do miss that. All right. That how much cobble quicker. do you reckon? Uh, not cobble. How much clay do you reckon I'm going to need for the cobble? Thousands. Probably a lot. Yeah. Thousands upon thousands. So I'll, I'll break the. Oh, is it a shill? A steel shovel? It's not a shovel. Good. So I'm going to work this down to the nub. Um, I should probably take a bit of a, uh, a breather rest. There are lots of deers around here, but I've not made any arrows, so I can't oh, wow. take advantage of that. Yeah, I know, but oversight or what? Um, the iron arrowheads were in the forge. Ah, yeah, I know. I, I saw them and everything. Um, oh, well, may maybe I'll correct that at some point. Maybe. 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 Can I have a small drink of water to get my stamina back up? Oh, I should do that, shouldn't I, instead of trying to hit these blocks with no stamina? Yeah, I try and keep it above halfway, but that that's always hard. Hydration's always a problem in this game. Yeah, I constantly need to have goldenrod with me so I can increase my stamina. Yeah, I mean, we've started to kind of pick the goldenrod or clean from the area. Because grain alcohol doesn't work the same as it used to, does it? Does it not? I thought it did. Not with building, right? Wow, like destruction. I thought it was different. I might have to test that. Oh, of course, of course, please do. I mean, never take my word for anything. Go out and test things. That's that's the only way we know for certain about stuff. Oh, it's the only way you can know for certain is if you perform the experiment yourself, if you will. Level seven though, 33 skill points to spend. I should probably do that. <laughs> yes, you should. I'm probably in the same boat. I should go and spend my skill points. See now, ideally, I'd like to put it in like my archery. But are there, are there archery perks? Yeah, uh, not perks. Uh, okay, because uh, as you know, I do prefer to put my points in perks rather than skills. The skills are kind of worked on by doing the skills. Yeah. Um, anyway, let's have a look. So I could get my first level in Pummel Peak. That would be quite good. I do use my club quite a lot, so that that seems like a good one. Um, Gunsmithing level two. Oh wow! Well. <laughs> Need to put some guns together and stuff like that. Uh, what else do I use a lot? I mean, I can take my first quality Joe level. That, that's a, that's a winner, right? Yeah. Yeah, I do that early game. Um, is there anything else I want? I'm gonna, and I'm going to save eleven points for when I'm like, oh, I really wish I'd saved ten points so I could take such and such perk. Um, I also try and do that. This is the first time I've ever tried to do so. Normally, I'm just like, yeah, whatever, I'll get all this stuff, everything's fine, yeah, gravy. No, I like to keep a few. Oh, my skin and gunsmithing is now level 10. Yay! It, it does go up quite quick when you're making all the gunpowder. It does go up quite quick. It's nice. Very nice, actually. Which means I'll get a nice. Ooh. So, I made my arrows earlier on. Yes. And then made a bow. And it was yeah. 289. Oh, nice. I should probably make a bow. I'm going to double my skill, like triple my skills on my bow making. I've got 119. Um, oh, wow. But I'm very good at swinging this shovel now. Level 10 yeah, in the mining yeah. skills. <laughs> Hopefully, mine will increase in trying to demolish this house. Uh, is it mining skills going up when you're. Bashing around with your, your your axe there. Oh no, that'll be construction tools. Oh, I right has it. This is the question we were just posing, right? I will find out. I will keep watching and see what it says. Yeah, that that would be good. That would be really good. I'd like to know. I would like to know. It'll be Sod's Law that I've just leveled up somewhere and completely missed it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's all right. You've still got a lot of stuff to do. A lot, lot of things to knock down. Uh, I'm completely out of stamina, and my shovel is about to break, so I might have to come back. Okay, I am going to quickly look at my skill points whilst I'm waiting for. One my thing stamina. I would really like to do at some point. Oh, it's already broken. One thing I'd really like to do at some point is set up a lumberjack farming facility in the cold biome. I think that's something we can do. Set up a, a small a little. Idea. Small little funnel where the lumberjacks can come down, and then we'll like have loads of explosives down the end or something. I don't know. Whatever we can do to take out a lumberjack, I'm relatively snappy. Um, that would be a good idea. I don't think I've actually put my bedroll in this building yet. No, I don't think you did. I think we had this discussion last time. Yeah, I've got a feeling that every sort of 20 minutes or so, I remember about it and then go do something else. 